hi there everyone and in this video i'm going to code uh, i'm going to make a notepad application a very simple notepad application um, this is my first video on on the topic of visual basic i'm going to use visual basic 2006 because that's what is used in our colleges nowadays um, I know it sounds strange if you're not from uh, India and stuff. Um, maybe I don't know in some in other boards or it may, they may use Visual Basic 2008 or 10 or 12, but <laughs> in my board they use 2006. I don't know why. Anyway, so it's going to be a video on 2006. So click on the standard exe and open. Okay. Um, maybe you have to increase your font size I mean increase your uh, increase the video resolution I guess to 720p or 1080 otherwise it may be difficult for you to watch this video I'm gonna name our notepad as our notepad and I click on this um, form and in the captions property I can do is change the name to our notepad then I will leave it as it is now I'm going to make a menu here so to make a menu go to tools and menu editor then let me open a notepad for you then it's going to be easier I guess oh shit Oh, okay, it open. Okay, so there are options like file, all this, edit, okay, format, okay, view, okay, help. Okay, so I'm going. It's going to be a very basic notepad actually. So it's not going to have all those options, but it's going to have a few of them. It's going to have file, then font is going to have, I guess. and it's going to have help then i can help here then next under file uh, sorry come on do it okay under file um it's going to have new then oh come on yeah it's going to have open then save well i just want to say one thing that is i'm not very confident with this because this is the first time i am making a not the first time actually i've made a few projects like this but uh okay i made only two projects like this so maybe i stumble on some things and then i'm going to pause this video because i'm not going to include all of them because uh, in other videos i know the stuff there's some logical error that's why it's, i stopped the video but here um i i may not know everything i may forget some things so I'm going to pause this video from time to time. I may pause this actually. Well, uh, another problem that I have been facing recently is my screen recorder is not working as expected. Like I'm co I'm recording long videos and then I realize that nothing has been recorded. It has encountered an error and this type of this type of things like uh, it's like it takes a lot of pain to make videos like this and then you talk and code and then after that if things don't get recorded <laughs> it's a pain in the butt so i'm going to pause this video from time to time save it and then proceed this way i may not lose work so these are the options here uh, let me explain a bit well 
if you can see these three dotted lines this means that these are this new open save save as exit this are the sub menu so file font help these are the <coughs> main menu and new open um, save save as these are the sub menus so let's check it once uh, okay let's check, uh, change the um, form layout position where it starts run it once okay so this is file font help if you click on file these options open up so <coughs> let me pause this video now <laughs> let's save it once <laughs> 